Throughout the 19th and 20th centuries, Beaver Countyans were privileged to have passenger rail service within minutes of their homes. One of the most popular stations was here in northern Beaver Falls, the Pittsburgh and Lake Erie Railroad's College Station. Beaver Falls had already enjoyed railroad service for over 25 years before the Pittsburgh and Lake Erie Railroad came to town in 1879. A passenger station in the lower end of Beaver Falls served the community for many years. Just north of the then borough limits was a community known as College Hill, which had grown up around the campus of Geneva College upon its arrival in 1880. College Hill Borough was established in 1892 and would soon become a prime location for p and -E growth. In August 1905, the railroad began constructing a new rail yard in College Hill. The new facility would house a roundhouse, turntable, water plant, coaling station, and storage for the company. It would become known as College Yard. In 1910, the railroad constructed a large, two-story passenger depot just south of the yard. This station would serve thousands of passengers and eventually grow to become one of the most popular stops on the entire Pittsburgh and Lake Erie line. In 1930, College Hill officially became part of the new city of Beaver Falls. On July 12, 1985, College Station became the final passenger rail station in Beaver County to serve the community. The final commuter train from College Station to Pittsburgh Station Square signaled the end of an era. Today, College Station is simply abandoned and decaying, left to rot for over 30 years. With the current trend in rehabbing old railroad stations, perhaps someday it too will get a shot at another life.